Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to download the Meteor Client for Minecraft 1.20. It's actually super simple, so let's just get into it. First thing you're going to want to do is click on the top link in the description, which will take us to the Meteor Client website. And then you want to come and scroll down to Downloads. And then you just want to go ahead and download the 1.20 version here by just clicking on it, and it should automatically download. Next, you'll want to go and click the second link in the description, which will take us to the Fabric Installer. And from here, you just want to go ahead and download the Universal Jar. And then again, it should download automatically. Now with those two things downloaded, we can just go ahead and drag them onto our desktop here. And then the next thing we need to do is go ahead and open up the Fabric Installer. To do that, you just want to right click on the Fabric Installer, click on Open With, and then select Java. If you don't have this Java option here, that means you need to go and download Java 17. There's plenty of tutorials online that can teach you how to do that, so just go get that downloaded real quick and then come back to this video. So once we open this up with Java, we should get this little window pop up here. All you need to do is make sure that the Minecraft version is 1.20. You want to make sure that this create profile is checked and then you can go ahead and click on install. It should take only a few seconds to install and if it installed correctly, you can go ahead and close out of this fabric installer and you can even delete the fabric installer from your desktop. Next thing you're going to want to do is open up the Minecraft installer and if fabric installed correctly, you should see this new fabric loader installation here. If you don't see it here, you can also click on installations at the top. Make sure that modded is checked right here and then you should see fabric loader 1.20 on this list right here. Next, you're going to want to hover over this and then click on the folder icon. This is going to take you to all of your Minecraft files. From here, you're going to want to go ahead and find your mods folder. Here's mine right here. If you don't have a folder like this, what you can do is go ahead and create a new folder. And then you can call it mods, M-O-D-S, all lowercase, just like this. Now you're going to want to open up this mods folder. And then all you need to do is drag in the Meteor Client into this folder. And now we can close out of this and launch Fabric Loader 1.20. Alright, so here I am loaded in Minecraft and as you can see it's working correctly because I have a Meteor Client in the top corner here. And once you get into a world to open up the mod menu, you just want to click on right shift on your keyboard. And as you can see everything is opened up. If you just want to close it, you just got to click on the little titles up here. So that's pretty much it. If this video helped you, a like and subscribe would be greatly appreciated.